Alright, after a quick check, just so last time I didn't mess up, this is Domina! Domina is a gladiator micromanaging training fighting thing that I did not remember. I should have done that, but oh well, let's get straight into it. There's new game, a new endless game. It's an experimental, and I've never tried new endless game, and it's better to learn, I suppose. The, the regular game is pretty difficult to win. Uh, it's, it's easy to play, I suppose, but to win it, oof, that final ending. So, endless game for funners and experimentations, because I've never done it. Domina has stopped working. Oh. <sighs> We're off to a great start, aren't we? Second try. New endless game. It works! The sun is setting on the once mighty Roman Empire. Violent rebellion erupts in the far territories while political corruption erodes the empire closer to home. Fearing that the citizens will revolt and attempt to re-establish the Republic, the Emperor has decreed that there shall be a year of epic gladiatorial games culminating in the greatest championship the Empire has ever seen. Affording unimaginable rewards of coin and glory, the Emperor hopes to revitalize commerce and establish the rule of law once again. But Rome is disintegrating in its clenched fist. The next local games are scheduled soon, and you aim to win. For some reason, Domina is, I think it's a really great game, but a lot of people don't know it. It's not getting the right stuff. I'm not the best person to do it anyway. But hey, let's go through the tutorial so everyone learns what happens. So we can learn together. Proceed with the tutorial, eh? And besides, the, tur the tutorial gives you like 500 extra gold, so that's also a plus. As the heir, as the heiress, to a once mighty Ludus in the heart of the Roman countryside, you see an opportunity to ride this wave of revitalized interest in the bloodshed to the ends of the empire, to burn out in a fabulous spectacle of violence and greed. Maybe I shouldn't spin my chair. That is that the clicking sound that people heard? Oh, all right. <laughs> learning as I go. Learning as I go. Having driven your family's ludus into the ground with poor business decisions and lack of integrity, your father bequeaths to you ownership of the ludus and its paltry holdings. On the dusty road home to assume the mantle of Lannister and Domina, a woman looks at you knowingly and proclaims, they'll never let you win. You try to put the old woman's icy stare out of your mind as your family begrudgingly surveys their new home and your father slowly fades towards his inevitable death. Alright, I have Narcissus, Savius, and Justinian. They're Thryaxes. <laughs> I don't know how else to pronounce it, eh? Thryax. A large man with a whip has presented itself at your villa and requests your ear. I see that there are games scheduled in a few days, and have heard that you plan to attend. I served your father for many years, but when he fell ill to the, and the Ludus turned to ruin, I had to find my daily bread elsewhere. I would be honored to return to the Ludus and train your men for this battle. Without me, these men will be slow and stupid lambs to the slaughter. Alright, Doctor! Enable automatic gladiator training and get humility. Ah, uh, our first opponent, Salonis. Agility 7, attack 4, damage 24, defense 2, and armor that is 27. 40. 40 armor defense. Pick gladiators. This guy, 1-1-1. One, 1-1-1. One, 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 one. Actually, maybe I don't. I have to. I gotta put someone in here. Well, this guy, whoever I put in here is gonna lose. Like, honestly, these guys have really trash um, items and skills. So, Savius, you got this. <laughs> I 
this man is lambs to the slaughter. A gift from the crowd. Oh, okay. pick up the sword. Please. He won. Oh, <laughs> this game is amazing. Look at that. A guy with no training and no armor whatsoever just beat a guy in full armor and decent training. He's not even a Marmilla yet. He played as a Marmilla. Now he's above leveled in everything compared to these guys. <laughs> oh man. <laughs> An old man enters your villa uninvited. He appears to be a high placed government official. He introduces himself. I am the magistrate. I was impressed by your showing in my games yesterday. Your prowess as a Lannister is evident, though you may be lacking in experience. Your father was a good man, and I am sorry to see his business and health failing. If you are in search of new slaves to turn into gladiators, I can provide you with agreeable stock. The smell of wine on this dusty old fuck's breath is off-putting. Yes, this is what I learned. This game has a lot of swearing in it. A, a very large amount. That's... Uh... It's... I don't know. Meditate is the most important. It makes the AI better. And I, when I say when you get a, a thousand, like 500 gold extra, getting a thousand, it's an estimated amount. Because after this... Uh... The Lu the, the the fighting guy, what's it called? After this battle the the warrior guy, uh the soldier. He comes through. Alright, so this guy is 3 3 and he has the best gear. I I don't know if this guy's gonna win. I hope he wins. <laughs> because then I'd lose this good guy, eh? But hey, he has better gear apparently. He has a longer reach as well. So let's just hope. I have no control over it. At the early stages, mind control is better. But when it gets to later and the AI gets better than you, it's not as good. There's, there are always uh, times when better than AI. These early stages are definitely better than AI. There's so many of these slave guys, they're like worthless. The this yes, the heavily armed soldier. A heavily armed soldier barges into you, Ludus announced. His armor is adorned with a fine detail, and you have gathered that he's an important person by the way he strikes fear into your slaves. I am the Legate, commander of the military detachment stationed nearby. I was impressed with your showing in my games yesterday, but if you want to win more bouts in the arena, you'll need better trained warriors, and I have many to spare. My warriors may not be as agreeable and cheap as the magistrate's useless wares, but at least they know how to wield the sword. The man demands wine as he reclines on your balcony. Yes, all these useless people. I have to sell them all. Get extra gold. I don't need to train many to and free them for the end. It's not. Uh... Ooh, this guy started off with 100 AI skill. Oh yes, you gotta look at that. This this man is like. I gotta move him up. All right. <laughs> so my system, the I get two Thoraxes, two Marmillas, two Rick. Right, uh, whatever. I'll, I don't have it memorized. 10, 11, 28. Ugh. 10, 11, 20. Ah, this guy's wounded too. He has the best stats, like I said, but he, he has nothing. I, I was a ward with him and he has super good stats, but he has no armor. 
since he has more levels and everything, the he'll get a and he has no weapon, he'll get a gift from the crowd, but I I just hope it's enough, alright. I'll get one slave and one twenty-two gold. It's not really worth it, but to keep him happy, eh? No gift from the crowd? Come on. Don't let Rune see us die. There we go. A gift from the crowd. Now turn it back around. Kill him. <laughs> that almost went very, very wrong. Oh my. This guy needs to be healed. This guy needs to really be healed. Your father calls you. You show great promise as a Lannister. Oh wait, no, he's dying. You show great promise as a Lannister. You are a natural. No doubt you seek glory in Rome. In order to qualify for the great championship games, you will need to win some regional championships. This map shows the local heroes, some of the massive behemoths for each region. I've estimated the cost of attending each of those games. Be aware that while these rewards are handsome, it will cost a great deal of resources to travel to these games. When you have achieved a victory at regional championship, I will tell you of Jupiter's blessings. Blech. <laughs> Ah, Jupiter's Blessings? I didn't know we only get them after we defeat a champion. Alright, aimed attack, and then buy food. Ah, hire employees, it's time. Now, a lot of people play it differently, eh? I've seen people play with agent, so they steal stuff. I, but some of these guys are totally useless. Like, uh, these food guys, and I don't know, wine guys. I go... I don't know how anyone can live without the architect for one, because you just have to make all the f you just have to upgrade your ludus. The favor, I mean, it makes everything cheaper that I go straight with him. This last guy though, I don't know who I should pick really. I'm kind of stuck between the Sakiros, the Bard, and the Educator. But I usually go Sakiros, even though it costs a hundred coin extra, because. It consumes nothing, and everything is super fast and cheap, and you'll see. Okay, Sakiridos, instantly prayer to Mars, so you get better AI skill, auto repair, and auto upgrade. And architects, start wall reinforcements, because there are some really mean things that happen, and if you- See, look at that! It's done learning prayer of Mars. It's just one time for everything. So, uh, there's some really mean things, like a flood, or the escape. Eh, sell them for the extra gold. Just keep on, just keep on giving this guy money, and he'll get give you all these bonuses at the start of the game. Super good bonus, eh? I usually don't go into mind control. I don't know why. It it is good. Oh, I should be reading these out. Alright, Prey to Mars, which is the first one I got. Unify your gladiator's mind and body for faster reactions when fighting under AI control. AI con AI control stuff is really good. Occasional upgrade to gladiator weapon. Well, I mean, it's just upgrades. That's good. Healing of gladiators happens automatically. That's amazing. Occasional upgrade to a gladiator's agility. Agility is like one of the most important gladiator stats. Or for now, I suppose. Then it's a uh, gladiator's weapon, but it doesn't do weapon. It does defense and strength. Strength is damage. Uh, agility is like running around, dodging and stuff, obviously. Defense is like when they would attack you and it just automatic blocks. But then you're like, what's weapon training? I, I think that weapon training is you attack them and they have less chance to defend against it. So like if your weapon attack is higher than their defense, you know? That's just my thoughts. 13, 9, I still didn't put anything on the sky fudge. <laughs> ah, I can't put him in because he has no wep- ah, man. It's only 130 and two slaves, that's not worth it, especially since I have 1200 anyway. I'm gonna keep healing the sky. I want to put this guy on the Retarius. But I like controlling Retariuses, so maybe I should put him on Mamilla. 
the Frax is the just normal training guys, I suppose. Then I usually go to Disarming Weapon, Critical Strike, and straight into Mermilla. Mermilla is super useful, but a lot of people, they go, uh, as I've seen so far, they go straight to the right and for Retiratus. Retiratus is, it's very, it's good, but not that good, I don't think. The wives of the Legate and Magistrate organize individual festivals for the Matralia, seeking a slave girl to be sacrificed for the ritual beating and banishment. Offer a slave to the House of Legate, replacing the slave girl will cost two coin. That's cheap. Offer a slave to the House of Magistrate, replacing that slave girl will cost three coin. That's also cheap. Offer slave girls to both houses, replacing the slaves will cost five coin. Offer slave to nobody. Well, uh, what's it called? When they have a better, uh, when you have a better reputation with them, when they host the duels, they give you better rewards. So I think I'm just gonna spend five coin for more coin later. Except the slave girls who curse your house and they're as they are beaten to death. Ah, that sucks. <laughs> That's super brutal, but it's the game, eh? <laughs> and now this guy is happy that I uh, or neutral that. I totally, uh, what's it called, didn't, uh, totally skipped out on his duel that he was making. Alright, so time to upgrade these guys. The best, okay, Greaves just straight to Onyx, but, uh, you should upgrade it to expensive ones so that one, uh, what's his face name, the armor guy, when he upgrades your guy, he upgrades something expensive and, and not something cheap like this 15 wooden gladius. So... I... I just spent quite a bit of money, eh? What? This guy hasn't done meditation training. Oh no! <laughs> Are all of them on meditation? They better be. Okay, they are. This guy's doing nothing. This guy finished repairing everything. 1-9-29-3. Oh. Yeah, this guy has better stuff. I believe he'll win. He also have a lot of health. Statistical. I don't know how long I've been recording. I don't even know if I can check. Ah, I can see it says on the open broadcaster. Did my guy just lose? Oh, he surrendered. Okay, he's gonna lose a lot of death. Oh, ah, oh, that was fast. <laughs> He wasn't important. Okay, Rucleus, you're going to be my go-to guy with your twin. Okay, lower that one. And so I can even out his skills. All right. Okay, then I'll go to Tharex just because I need a guy right now. Fudge, I s lost a lot of gold then. That's it, I'm gonna save the rest of my gold. Ah, <sighs> oh, man. Alright, time to go to Improved Anvil. Weapon Disarming, Critical Strike. That's gonna take a while, so I don't need to watch that for a while. Food, Water, and Wine are important today. Let's see, 11, 1, 12. Alright, this, this one guy is gonna be easy. 
uh, the less gold that they cost, the cheap, the easier it is to beat them. Uh, that guy I estimate is gonna be a twenty, a twenty skill. The big gladiator champions they have twenty agility, twenty weapon, twenty defense, twenty strength, probably, and then like eighty meditation. So that's what I'm gonna uh, guess. I mean, I can check just by clicking on it. Ah, oh, this 30, it's a, it's a Retariatus. Oh, alright. This is not a... Easy, this guy's definitely gonna win. If he doesn't win, I... I, uh... <laughs> If he doesn't win, I'm gonna get my controls. <laughs> he won. That's good. I got two more useless slaves. Sell. I usually keep eight guys. It's good to have them training. Now he has no meditation. Alright, he's gonna finish reinforcing those walls. Then, I would like him to start building palaces. Palaces increase your training speed for everything, and so it's good to just have uh, these uh, five. I just have ten of them. Then I usually go into a weapon, even though it costs a ton, but weapons cost a huge amount. Oh, I can pick three. That's the problem, eh? Okay, I believe he's gonna get uh, crowdfunding. They're all higher levels, so if he gets crowdfunding, then. <laughs> oh no, it's this one. All right, I got. I didn't check. It's the one v one. All right, I can do this. <laughs> Give me crowdfunding. Oh wait, no. No, it's not. That's odd. Alright, he's gonna play as a uh, Huh, I wonder why it used to Ah, save, yes. Just when they're higher levels, they destroy them. Especially Marmillas. <laughs> Marmillas do a ton of damage. Again. Why people don't like Vermilla. Vermillas are great. One of your cousins stopped by for a visit. He appears to have fun some financial trouble, but he has some items straight. Alright. So I don't know why you would give him coin for water, wine, or food. Because even if you don't want to give him coin, you should still give him coin for the large slave, because you can sell that large slave that has fought a gladiator before for more coin than you give him. Look, you give him 18 coin for this large slave, you have acquired a new gladiator. Let's say I don't want this guy. I can sell him for 305, alright? Just putting that out there, you should never say no to that guy. Just, that's not a, that's not a good idea. Ooh, I've been filming for 23 minutes. I'll stop at 25. Alright, I'll put this I I'll put the, this guy is less trained but has much better gear. I have more money, so I'll give this guy better shield. Better armor. I worry about the weight a lot because... The weight of the things usually... I don't have weight training yet. That's a baddie. Alright. Okay, so Gauntlet. One on one battles in a grueling series until one team is vanquished. Alright. Now I got it. <laughs> but I'm not controlling the guy. I, I used to last yesterday.
this one guy is wrecking house. A cleaning house wrecking house. What the fuck is Alright. And on this note, I will end the video because not only is it a while, I am also needing break, I suppose. <laughs> 25 minutes, eh? It's not much. But I don't think I'm going to edit this one that much. So, I'll see you all in the next video. Bye.